All right, so here we are on your roof. I want to show you what you have going on here. So this is Elevation K. You can see they didn't pay for it. You can see the shingle coming off here. Elevation O, or I, I, I'm sorry, also not paid for. What we're marking here is the valley liner and how far it's going to have to go. Elevation O, they also didn't pay for, but you have shingles missing. So that's why we go ahead and document the valley liner, how far this valley is going to have to go underneath it for that to be worked. Now let's go up here. E, also not paid for, also has a damaged shingle. One thing to take into consideration is your felt overlap. Y is already paid for, so your felt is going to have to go under here, which is the underlayment underneath your shingles. It's going to have to be overlapped by four to six inches. We have it marked out at six inches here. Now, if you keep going, you're going to see you also have this going on here. You've got creasing. The tab's falling off. This is section E, not paid for. If we go back over here. This section here was Q, which was paid for. Back into the felt overlap, you can see here as it goes this way, felt's gonna have to go over. We're gonna have to get into this slope. Here's Z, also not paid for. Thing about that would be, you're missing a shingle here. It's where the insurance pulled the shingle. Your felt overlap is gonna go to here, but they're not paying for this section. Doesn't make any sense. Go back over here. They paid for this section. This valley goes to here. What about these shingles here? Are they gonna fix that? S is not paid for. You've got your felt overlap here from the front of the roof, which was paid for. They're gonna have to do the felt overlap here. Climb up here. This is T. T was paid for. Same thing here, felt overlap. Even though on P that's not paid for, you got shingles falling out that they didn't pay for. Go over to M, this was paid for. You can see the shingles coming off. So that's great. Think about it. They didn't pay for this one, which this shingle here, if you can see, goes up underneath this valley. So how are we not gonna tear into this one? I'm not too sure. Here's V, they also didn't pay for. Remember AC's back here where you had that shingle that's gone, they paid for this. You have the felt overlap, so you're already gonna be tearing into this, which goes into here. There's no transition. Your felt is gonna to have to go there. Next one to go to would be X. This was also not paid for. As you can see, this thing's got shingles all the way off of it. That needs to be picked up on. Now, if we go over here, R was paid for. However, J right here was not. Well, if we look at our valley liner, that's gonna go underneath there. We're gonna to need to tear all these shingles out to make that happen. Now back to the front. This one was easy enough because they had paid for everything here, but it's everything back here that they didn't pay for. Your felt, felt overlap that you need to take into consideration. Everything you need to do to build this right to get this paid for. So because of this, we're asking for a full roof.